Recently, I was speaking with a veterinarian and she commented that pink eye was bad this summer. And then she further commented that pink eye is bad every summer somewhere. And I think that's very true. Um, there's a reason we see pink eye more in the summer than other times of the year. One is we have abundance of daylight. Uh, daylight is damaging to epithelial tissue. So the cornea of the eye and the tissues that surround the eye can be damaged from that abundant sunlight. We also have a lot more dust and pollen, which irritates the eyes. When they reach down to uh, graze and those tall weeds and tall grasses scratch their eyes, that again damages that eye. And, and we're, we're breaking down the innate immunity, that physical barrier to prevent these animals from getting these infections. Um, the other thing that we can have that breaks down immunity is stress. So anytime we work cattle, if we work them uh, and we uh, are not doing it in a proper manner, then we're going to stress those cattle and that will also break down the immunity of the eye. Typically, uh, the clinical signs that we're going to see with that is if you're closely watching, you'll start to see some increase in tears. Uh, that will be followed by some redness. And then you're probably going to see some small white spot on the eye or grayish or blue spot. As far as treatment goes, uh, there are a variety of antibiotics that have been used for treatment. Um, strongly suggest that you contact your veterinarian and um, see what their recommendations are. When we have a cow or a calf or whoever with pink eye, we need to uh, separate those from the herd because there's going to be a large number of bacteria involved with that and that can spread easily. Uh, we probably should cover that eye because that helps protect that eye uh, or put them somewhere in the shade uh, so that the sun's not bothering as much. Also, we need to have good fly control because flies can carry the bacteria from one animal to the next and so we want to be careful with that. As far as prevention is concerned, uh, making sure that we meet the nutritional needs of that animal, we keep them healthy, we don't stress them. If you'd like some more information about pink eye, uh, we have a good fact sheet that has a lot of good information. We'll put that at the SUNUP website.